Welcome to Tablet Guide. Today we're going to be looking at the Remarkable 2 paper tablet from Remarkable. This device's primary functions is to take handwritten notes, read and review documents. It doesn't offer all the bells and whistles of a tablet like the iPad for instance, but you can read PDFs and ebooks with it. What it does, it does brilliantly. Let's take a look. Here we have the Marker Plus pen. This one actually comes with an eraser on the top. Next up we have the Folio. This is available in three colours. Black leather, brown leather and a grey polymer weave. It's also magnetised to drop the tablet in. Next up we have the tablet itself. Here we have the USB-C cable for charging. The battery life of this device is actually two weeks. The size of the tablet is 7 by 3 6 inches by 9 6 9 inches and it's very thin. It weighs only 403 grams and it has a resolution of 1872 by 1404 pixels. It has 8 gig internal storage and supports PDF and EPUB formats. Sliding the tablet out of the box and holding it for the first time, you realise just how well made this is. It's got a real expensive feel to it. On the top left is the power button. Flip it over and the bottom left houses the USB-C port for charging. Down the left side of the tablet screen is a menu section where you can choose the following pen options. The next menu contains stroke choices, thin, medium, thick colours, black, grey, white and exported colours for the highlighter. Eraser section. This is where you'll be heading to erase all parts and sections of the page with a supplied pen. If you have ordered the Marker Plus, simply turn it over and rub out what you don't want. Page management. This is where using the menu bar across at the top of the page you can tag pages, email pages, convert pages to text, move pages, duplicate and delete etc. Tag section. Tag pages for future reference and search. Layers template section. Just like Photoshop, you can add delete layers to your work. The last tab gives you access to set up a new page, notebook settings and to change the landscape mode should you so wish. Coming at this review from the perspective of a designer and illustrator rather than a marketing type person who regularly takes notes, but I have to say the feeling of drawing on paper on this device is incredible. Selection tool. Select all or parts of the page to move, resize and or delete. The Marker Plus pen is nicely weighted and feels good to use. Tilt is supported and works fantastically with the pencil tool. It's battery free so it won't need charging. Here's some technical details about the tablet.
Here's some technical details about the pens. When using the pencil, it actually feels like you're using a real pencil. It even sounds like you're using a real pencil. The page menus and navigation system are easy to understand and navigate. There's no unnecessarily complicated UI here. It's easy to use. Swipe down and you're presented with a section to add, delete, new folders, pages and sheets. Simple. Press on a page for a few seconds to select it and once you have registered an online account with Remarkable, it makes it easy to then email your work with a click of a button. Once you have the desktop app or mobile app installed, it makes it easy to transfer PDFs etc to and from the tablet for reviewing and editing. Remarkable has an online service called Connect which provides unlimited cloud storage and instant file accessibility across your devices and a three year protection plan for a small monthly fee. If you don't subscribe, only files used and synced online in the last 50 days will continue to be stored in the cloud. As previously mentioned, this isn't an all singing, all dancing multimedia device. You can't watch movies on it, browse the web for trousers or catch up on your socials, but it does brilliantly what it was designed to do, note taking. That said, it's also great for drawing and sketching too. It really does live up to its name. Most people looking to purchase this will be for its type capabilities and functionality and it obviously does a great job of that. As long as your handwriting is fairly legible it has no problem turning your notes into editable text. The highlighter has a nice way of aligning itself to the text when you draw over it. Due to a recent software upgrade, the tablet now supports pinch and zoom. Here's the pen types, ballpoint, fine liner, marker, pencil, mechanical pencil, paintbrush, highlighter and calligraphic. The 
Marker Plus pen is nicely weighted and feels good to use. Tilt is supported and works fantastically with the pencil tool. It's battery free so it won't need charging. Here you can also browse through and add one of the many page templates and backgrounds provided. For example, storyboards, checklists, planners and a wide variety of line pages. Whichever magnetised pen you use, both can be attached to the front, side and back of the tablet, although the side is the strongest connection. That said, even when the tablet is housed within the protective folio cover, the pen sticks out along the edge somewhat and can easily be knocked off, so beware. Here's the tablet scrolling through some PDF documents. It does have a weird page refresh, but you soon get used to it. This is a great device for taking notes, it's certainly the best I've ever used. It is quite expensive, but you do get what you pay for. That's about it for this review. Don't forget to like, subscribe to this channel and keep coming back. We'll see you next time.